WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Good evening, I'm meteorologist Sabrina Fine. Well, maybe you have lost your gloves. Maybe they got stolen at some of the uh, Christmas lighting shows. You're going to want to buy them really quickly. We have temperatures going 20 degrees cooler and our first, I'd say significant, just because we have snow actually accumulating on the roads forecast this week. Right now, though, taking a live look outside and we're noticing the clouds are still in place, although it's still staying fairly dry. We will end up seeing a little bit of that shower activity just in the matter of hours. Temperatures sitting at 46 degrees in the Inner Harbor, Bel Air, you're at 45, Elkton 44. Now with the clouds tonight is going to stay fairly warm warmer than normal for us, but then get ready. We have a cold front tomorrow that's really going to drop our temperatures. Also, when we increase the wind speeds, making it feel extremely chilly outside. So winds currently only seven in Parkton and three out toward Columbia. They will increase for everyone. Sustain now 10 to 20 miles per hour and they could gust close to 35 to 40 miles per hour, and they're going to increase for us, especially as we get close to the late afternoon hours when that front moves through. Right now, the radar is not picking up anything, but this will change. We have two systems we're watching tomorrow, so one little impulse, and then we also have the cold front that's going to bring some rain. You can see the showers already moving throughout Indianapolis as well as pushing through Kentucky. That is on its way, and this is just one system that we're talking about for Monday. We have a series of them over this week, and that's what's going to lead to more significant snow. So round one, we have a low pressure system that's going to skirt its way along the coastline. That will bring us morning showers. Round two, we have a cold front coming through over the late afternoon. Total, we're looking at maybe a few hundred seven inch, possibly two tenths of an inch of rain. If any precipitation is still out there around midnight, we could see some flurries, maybe rain snow mix coming our way. Then fast forward into Tuesday, right? We have high pressure and control clockwise flow. That's going to give us our winds out of the northwest and it is cold. This is the day temperatures fall from the 60s down into the 40s. So at least it's dry under mostly cloudy skies. But notice a little bit of the snow action hanging around it. There are two impulses that are going to come our way on Wednesday, and that is the day we are looking at snow accumulating. So Tuesday, you want to go on out. Make sure you have the salt. Get ready for the winter season. You might need to go ahead and use it for you uh, late Tuesday night on into Wednesday when we're anticipating this stronger snow event. Here's the rain, though, that we're talking about with the first two systems on us. By 8 a.m. Monday, Still just looking at cloudy skies for us, but remember those winds are going to be very high and you might see some of your Christmas decorations in your neighbor's yard. I wouldn't be surprised. By 145, we have a slight chance of rain. Very uh, light for us moving through the area now by 330 increasing. Here's that cold front by 5 o'clock. Look at this, the Inner Harbor right along the Beltway, so portions of Owings Mills down through Columbia. You could be dealing with some of the stronger showers. Nothing anticipated to be severe, though. And then by 545, moving through Annapolis, clipping Essex and pushing out toward Elkton. It is not going to be very strong rain. In fact, it moves very quickly for us. And we'll end up seeing maybe uh, some clearing, and then quickly those clouds build back in on Tuesday. Tuesday and here we go. Get ready. Look at this. 130. We get stronger snow in the area. We'll detail that out in just a little bit for you. For tomorrow, though, 11 a.m. cloudy, 57 by 1 o'clock, 63. That chance of showers. Remember, it will be warm tomorrow, 62, but very windy. Temperatures fall Tuesday to 44. Wednesday, 39 degrees between a half an inch and an inch and a half of snow. We'll break down the timing for you in just a bit. Mallory.